Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to City Skylines, where the rain is pouring, but the city is growing very nicely indeed. Things are going very, very well. Um, we're expanding beautifully out into this area. We've got a lot of space over here that we haven't utilised just yet. But in general, things are chugging along very nicely. Uh, we started work on this area in the last one put down a university, put down all sorts of sports facilities as well to make almost a little sports district and we've got a bit of demand for housing too. We're pushing 30,000 people living in the city now which is pretty incredible to be honest how quickly this city's come along from what was a single road over here. Um, where was it? Is it this one? No, it was this one I believe. Yeah, Tom Chittock Street, that's the one. And yeah, it's just grown and grown and grown. Um, we're doing we're doing really really well, I think. This is the first ever city I've built in this game, um, so I might be wrong, but I feel like we're doing pretty well. But yeah, there's a couple more things that I want to get going. Uh, money is not a problem for us anymore. Uh, demand for housing is actually dropping now as these blocks go up here, which is good. So hopefully we'll have that under control shortly. Um, Organic has been telling me about these little junctions here. Apparently they're not the best idea in the world because having all these little junctions actually causes traffic where I didn't realise traffic lights go in um, which could be the reason why we're getting all this congestion along this road in addition to these bus type highway roads. So he recommends using some uh, flyovers and things like that. Uh, flyovers is that what I mean? that sort of thing if that makes sense so roads which come off and go over the other roads and down sort of like junctions we would call them here in the UK um, I don't know if you guys call them ramps or exits whatever they are so we're gonna have to look into doing that at some point and um, it's not gonna be the first thing that I want to do but it is gonna be something that we do need to do pretty soon uh, because we don't want to be in a situation where things aren't great. Um, let's take a look at what we can build that's new shall we? Because we had a little look at some of this stuff in the last one to help bring some tourists to the city. So we've got things like the fountain of life and death that might be quite cool. Uh, what else do we have? And we've got this massive skyscraper but we can't afford that yet. So we're on our way to being able to afford things like that, but I don't think we're quite there yet. Which isn't a problem. Um, it's not necessarily a bad thing. This is a bad thing though. I mean, this is pretty much gridlocked now, isn't it? So many fires in the industrial district. I don't know if that's normal. I'm guessing it probably is, but... Uh, we do apparently need to get some more crematoriums or something over here, I think because we are starting to get the skulls coming up again. Um, so we'll just keep an eye on that a little bit. Uh, same deal over here. So actually I might look at putting a crematorium in somewhere around here if I can. Potentially, I mean I really want it in this little area. So we might have to demolish a house. Uh, <laughs> Which I know Pillock's going to be getting on my case about because he keeps saying about how I destroy people's homes to make room for things. Um, and it is true. But it can't be helped. It really can't. Um, I also want to look at getting some underground stations and things put in. Because I think these would be quite cool. So I kind of want to get an underground station put in towards the industrial district so people can get to and from work and I also want to get one put in over here near the office district if possible so we might have to knock down some of this but I'm cool with that so that is in um, that looks very weird how do we do this then right so we build the tracks like this do we Here we do. Okay, so that's interesting. 
So we could potentially put underground stations or even stations like this. There's elevated ones as well. Uh, do the tracks go underground or do they go overground? Let's take a little look at that. Uh, where did I put the station? How have I lost the station already? <laughs> what the hell? Where did I put it? Uh... What on earth? I've complete. Oh, there it is. Jeez. Anyway. So. No, that doesn't work. Uh, do we have to lower it? Yeah, maybe we have to lower it then. It's quite difficult to. Okay. Um, so yeah, we can put this really deep, it turns out. Alright, well remember we've done that. I want to look into that a little bit off camera perhaps. We can put trains in as well. Uh, what is this? Oh, an airport. Jeez, we haven't even unlocked that yet. But yeah, putting in trains is something that I definitely want to do. Uh, metro trains. Especially underground, because I think that might be a really good idea for getting people to and from places to avoid some of this car problem. So actually, it'd be pretty cool to have a underground station over here somewhere. Perhaps we could even put it in sort of in this area, because we haven't got anything here yet. So let's get a little road coming off of here, shall we? Uh, like so. We'll join that up with this road. Uh, and we're going to have to join that up. Wait, hang on. What? Why can I not... Okay, I can't join it onto that road, weirdly enough. The slope is too steep. That's odd. Hmm. Never mind. Anyway, we'll go ahead with our plan. And we will put in... Yeah, and we'll put in another underground station. They're actually quite big, aren't they? We'll do that there. And what I want to do is just see if I can run the tracks across to here. I'm hoping that the fact that there is a river there isn't going to cause a problem. Wait, why is it going to demolish things? Oh, because I need to lower it? Oh, wow, okay. Um, this is... Yeah, that's a... Okay. No, no, it's not. Oh, I see, because... Oh, because of the slope. So we're going to have to go deeper than that, are we? Yeah, we are. We're going to have to go pretty... Just make sure I'm not going to... demolish anything here. Is, is that actually going to cause an issue? Because it seems to not want to go any further than that. Why can it not... Oh, is it because of the... The terrain? Because it's down a slope? I mean, that would be pretty annoying if it was. But not the worst thing in the world, because we could maybe put a train terminal in around here somewhere. Uh, so actually, that probably wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Uh, yeah, it's quite difficult to do this, it turns out. I wasn't, wasn't expecting this to be quite so awkward. Yeah, so we can bring... It's going to demolish quite a bit, and I'm not really happy with that. And also, it's just, like, showing up as red, and I don't know why that is. Like, why is it red? 
Oh, is it because of money? It's because of money, I see. Wow, it turns out this is really expensive, which actually makes sense, because things like this in real life are really expensive. Right, okay, so that actually makes sense then, I see. What's the space already occupied by, though? I'm not really seeing what the space is occupied. It's a little bit temperamental, I'll be honest, this. It's not... It's not the best. Right, there we go. So were we too deep? It is very expensive though, it's got to be said. Uh, perhaps we can come over this way and put a, a bit of a terminal in here somewhere? That might be an idea. Like, put it to there. Uh, is that connected? I don't think it is, is it? That's very annoying, I've got to say. Why is that not... Oh, that's so frustrating. I don't understand why it's like that. Can we join these two bits up or... Is, is that not going to work? This <laughs> is actually quite difficult. I thought this was going to be pretty easy, but it's not. Um, the problem is, I can't tell... Is that... Is that joined up now? Yes, it is. Okay. Right, so it comes to here at the moment. And I kind of want to get it put in... Joe, you know we're going to pause while this happens. Uh, I want to get one of these, but they're quite expensive. An elevated metro station. Well, maybe just a normal metro station, to be honest. It is going to demolish a fair amount, but... I think it'll be worth it in the long run. So, let's see if we can at least get the train running from there to there. Right, and this is how we do a line, I see. Right, so we'll do a line shortly, but we'll do the tracks first. Oops, that's not tracks. Right, so the train comes to here. And then what we want to do is get it going across the river over to the housing area. But we're obviously going to have to save up a bit of money to do that. So we'll speed up a bit. We'll leave that for the time being. But that's good. It's good to get that starting off at least. Because it'd be pretty nice to... Um, lost it again. <laughs> How do I keep doing this? This place is like a maze. Is that it there? No. Or is it? <laughs> I honestly don't know. Huh. Oh well. As I was saying, I want to get a bridge going across it. What the hell? Oh, it needs power, of course. We don't need to worry about that though for now, I don't think. So this is all growing nicely. Um, can we put some more housing in around here? We can. Uh, I actually want to divide that up a bit though. Like so. so let's go to the end and then I want to get a curvy road. To go back to here. Is that a curvy road? I'm not sure it is actually. Yeah, it says it's a curved road. Why is it not curving? Oh, well, we'll just do it like this, shall we? Uh, why will that not... Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, that's right. You have to sort of do where you want the curve to begin, don't you? So we'll do it like that. Um, and then we'll... I think we'll stick to the... Should we stick to the high density? Yeah, let's, because the demand for housing is pretty huge again. 
So let's stick with this. These people are going to be living pretty close to the train tracks, but um, it's not the end of the world. Like that. Uh, it's kind of weird that it's done down there. I might have to paint that in. But this will probably need to be commercial along here to make up for that. Uh, where's the paintbrush? There it is. Uh, why is it not painting? Uh, game? Can you please paint this? Oh, I guess it's because it's... Oh, do you know what? Whatever. It's because it's already zoned, I'm guessing, but never mind. That's fine. That will start to build. The money's coming in again, so we can look to build some more tracks. I am excited about this train station, though. I think this is going to be really good. If we can get trains going... I think that would be a massive help for the city. Uh, is that joined up? It's, the one thing I've noticed is it's very difficult to... to get the tracks to work. Distance too short. Right, there we go. We're good. We're good again. Uh, okay, so... If we come to, like, here, can we go under... We can actually go under the river. Oh, no, it's going to do it as a bridge, but that's fine. I'm, I'm fine with that. No, it's not. It's going to go underground. And actually, that's a lot better, then. Uh, whereabouts is the track laying there? Right, we haven't got enough money to go to there, but I think it's laying at that level. No, maybe one one higher? I don't know. Anyway, we've got it. What the hell is going on there? What's that little icon we've got? Oh, I see that's where the track is. So for now, the track's good to here. So it will start here, well that's one of the stops anyway, and it will come all the way through here. It will stop here, at this station, then it will come across the river to here. Maybe we need to get it going round here as well. That would be pretty cool. I know, I know, I know, I know you need power and water, but you're just going to have to get on with it for now. Uh... Unless we can build some water across, perhaps. Should we just do that? Just to shut it up? Perhaps we do. Right. Down to there. That'll do for now. Right. Shut up about water. We'll put some pylons in, though. Again, we're not going to need that long term. It'll just be a short term fix. Right. Why don't you like that? Honestly, the game is a bit weird sometimes with stuff like this. I'm not the biggest fan of the way it sometimes just makes a fuss out of little issues. I mean, other than that, it's fine. But yeah, occasionally it turns little issues into quite big issues, I think. Space already occupied. Why is it already occupied? Gotta try and figure out the height of this, I think. Is it there? Yeah, there we go. Uh no, oh, again, it's sort of Hmm. I'm not sure why it does this. If if you guys have any recommendations for this, let me know please in the comments below because it's it's a bit annoying, I'll be honest. I mean, I can't even... It's 
So I can build it to like here and then it causes a problem. Is that cause of... Oh, there we go. It's working again. What the hell? I don't know. It's kind of a little bit buggy, I think. Anyway, that's connected up to there now. So that's good. And then from here, we can get it going somewhere over here. Which will be pretty cool, actually. Um, but I think that's where we'll leave it for today. We'll finish this off in the next one, because I want to do a bit of reading up on, on how this works. Because it's a little bit... A little bit janky at the moment, so I want to figure it out. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. If I am, let me know in the comments below, but that's it for this episode. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.